Okay, land man, we out here up and grinding early, man. And what I want to show y'all is one of these quotes from my guy LeBron James, the goat, the goat James, baby. <laughs> here it is, right here. We are our own worst enemy. Hey, like a lot of times, I always say, man, anytime you having issues with something, you probably need to look at the man in the mirror first, man, because like Mike said, I'm starting with the man in the mirror. You gotta start with the man in the mirror first, man, because a lot of times we our own worst enemy. We get in our way, and it's, it's normally our our uh, mind that gets in our own way. Why would I do this? Why would I try that? Because, you know, so let's let's try to break out of that this morning, man. We're going to try to push forward. If you got something that you want to try, go try it. Give it a shot. And uh, let's, let's just do it, man. Don't be your own worst enemy. Don't be your own roadblock. And with all that out of the way, man, let's get right into the video, bro. Now, check it out. Look, also, before we get started, make sure y'all like the video and comment uh, comment mirror down below, man. That's going to do two things for y'all. Number one, uh, every single Friday, we give away $50 in VC Cash App or a copy of a video game. We're going to be doing that. I'm going to be doing that today, man. I should have some time this evening whenever I stream. I'm going to stream whenever I stream. I just hadn't had a chance to stream. I was on call all last week. I told y'all I was in the data center all, all night. But that ain't nothing that y'all care about, man. Make sure y'all just like the video, do that, man. And then uh, and watch out for the bots down there. And uh, we just going to get right into it, bro. Check it out. Bam! Hey, my boy, listen. When an OG Grandmaster Sensei says something like this, bro, you got to listen to it, bro. This is my guy Chase Money, one of my one of my guys from um from way back in the day, boy. He said the VC is too dang high, man. And you know this, man. This is something I've been trying. Hey, listen, bro. I've been trying to tell y'all this for the last for the last little while or whatever for the last few years. Nobody uh. Nobody don't want to listen. Nobody don't want to care. So, hey, look, hey, I just put up there my nickel. Hey, that's what I put up there, man. Hey, hey, it is what it is, man. That's what I put up there to him because that's my guy, man. He just said, listen, I'm going to be honest with y'all. It's really time to go on the VC strike. We can't, we can't be, 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 I'm not, I'm not coming out and, 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 and crying about it or doing, I ain't doing none of them videos. I'm just telling y'all what we as a team need to do as 2K. You just got to go on no VC spent joints, bro. We just got to, we got to go out there and just not buy boost. Take a L here and there if you want to. Uh, we got to go out and, and, you know, no, don't buy boost. Don't buy Gatorade. Just play the game raw and just do what we got to do. But most people are not going to do that. They're not going to do that. They're not going to sacrifice the fact that I might miss one shot here, one shot there. But if everybody do it, we on equal playing ground. No, it's 2K. And it's the 2K community. And the community is uh, we our own worst enemies. So what we're going to do is instead of everybody saying we're going to do something to try to help ourselves for the betterment of the game and to get the game to a certain level. Nope. Oh, oh, this this I be right here. Oh, Jay said he's not. Oh, Jay and Brute don't be don't be playing with boost. I'm pulling up. That's what we do. I'm gonna go out there and try to beat you and, and try to get a cheap dub off you with no boost and no Gatorade. That's what you're gonna be trying to do. And instead of just trying to everybody come together and uh and try to get this thing straightened out and uh you know hit them in the pocket and all that it's just never going to happen because somebody's always going to try to as long as there's a way to get a competitive advantage in the game instead of doing stuff like that high iq plays like that to gain a, a competitive advantage like this like this right here i don't i know i can't dunk on this guy drive slow three people bite down hit gambit trays up splash down instead of doing that you know i, I want i'm gonna buy a dunk boost so i can punch on the center or whatever like that and i don't even have to think so I get it, man, but he's he right. We are our own worst enemy, as far especially when it comes to that uh comes to the VC and stuff. We're not gonna change, and it's because we get a competitive advantage. And as long as there's a competitive advantage to be gotten by buying VC, like time time saving vines VC, I don't care about that. But as long as there's a competitive advantage to be gotten by buying it, people gonna keep on doing it, man. It just is what it is because everybody wants to try to. That, that, this this thing is right here. People that watch sports, you know they watch sports. People that watch other stuff, they watch other content. They're not content creators. Everybody in the 2K can community is a content creator you go to everybody's channel they done tried to make a video or they done, done something like this we got not everybody because a lot of people not but you understand what i'm saying the majority of the people they just trying to get a screenshot people that ain't never even gonna stream or even putting nothing up trying to get a screenshot on you so that like that's that's what it is and they just want to send that and be like make themselves feel better because they because they beat you so as long as there's a competitive advantage to be gotten that you know people just gonna that's what they're gonna do anyway up next we got that guy solo he says uh this nba 2k season's uh, season four check point comment down below a lot of people are saying he's a uh, level five here i think i might level 10 or something i haven't played the game in almost two weeks i might be around that 16 year area i know t is on zero on these boys uh he's at 22 because uh because i took a couple of days off one person say 35 uh he says 23 hey i ain't a lot of y'all man i was on, like i said i'm on call last week bro so being on call uh it's, it's rough man because they may call me at any time 
and uh, I'm, on, I'm I'm technically working 24 hours a day, so it is what it is. So at any time I can get a call, I'm gonna have to break out and go do something. So it it, it was a rough week last week. That's why I didn't play at all. But hey. That's, that's where we at with it, man. Up next, hey, we got uh, Paligo, and he's talking about the seasons also. He says, I was wrong for defense. See, our own worst enemy. I was wrong for defending seasons in 2K22. Uh, might be very, very demotivating when you have a few busy weeks during a season with good rewards. That's right. And then, so Power, that's what he says. He says, if you're late, if you're late to a season, it feels like why even play? I remember in 22 when I, when, when like one month, in with when like one month in, I criticized seasons and people got really mad, and that's what I'm saying. So, somebody like me, everybody's not like me. I'm going to be able to go out there and complete this season because I had a busy week this week. I couldn't play the game at all. I probably haven't played at all. I've been just dropping videos on the other channel, the sports channel, uh, you know, the Easy Does It channel or whatever. I got a name that or something like that, but y'all understand what I'm saying. Like, I, I've been doing so much because that's all I could do because I couldn't play the game, and then now. I'm a little bit behind, but I could just turn on my stream and say, hey, I need five for the four for the wreck, and then we can get busy. So I can do that. A lot of people can't do that. They don't have people to play with. They're gonna have to sit here and uh and and mess with randoms and all of that stuff like that. They're gonna have to be like how Dime works saying, I'm in the W the rest of the year. The wreck is in shambles. That's how it is for a lot of us. Because again, like I said, we are our own worst enemies, man. We're not gonna, we're gonna get in the wreck, we're not gonna pass the ball, we're not gonna do nothing. We're not gonna try to help people out or or, or make the right play or any of that. No, 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 no. What we're gonna do is you know you get more rep for an assist or an alley than you do for actually scoring the ball but on the fast break man just here they go shoot i'm, I'm trying to get legend man i'm trying to get legend why y'all don't why y'all don't oh, i'm gonna get these buckets right here shut the f up shut the f up dudes with six thousand points right now talking about they're gonna try to hit legend bro chill bro you, you that's not about to happen man but say it is what it is Don work also said this mike Mike got to hit the undo button on on this patch, man. Hopefully this hopefully this is just a placeholder. I'm tired of watching these trash centers bum uh bumming open uh standard layups after the other center jumped. Hey, that's it right now, man. But like I said, we asked for them to fix the paint defense. We didn't say how we need to fix it. We didn't say what was wrong. We didn't specify any of that. We just said paint defense needs to be fixed. Mike actually went from stream to stream and asked people, what do you mean that it needs to be fixed? He's trying to get some clarity on it. Nobody can never really say that. People just hitting too much in the paint. They weren't saying they're hitting too many dunks in the paint. They're not saying that they're dunking on people or stuff like that, being very specific. I got him walled up and he's scoring on me. You couldn't really say that because that didn't happen. The only real issue was a center or two people could be down that dude, let me just take off, and he's punching that rock, rock on everybody. And that's what was happening. And that was the main issue. But now, the way that they tuned it, because we weren't specific, how did they tune it? They just said, you can't make nothing down there unless unless you just uh, butt booty naked. And then you still might smoke that joint, man. So it is what it is. Anyway, we just gonna keep on going, man. Man, my, my guy down work. Down work is a cornucopia of stuff because he's unfiltered, just just coming straight out with it, man. And I love it, man, because it's good for me. Good for me, because all I gotta do is just, just come on here and just look on Twitter. But hey, he said, shooting off a dime is such a smooth feeling. Y'all dudes be tripping about the dimer speeds up my shot. Again, like what I'm saying, man, that's why the theme is your own worst enemy. Instead of learning how to shoot, Shooting off dimer is so much smoother because you catch the ball in the position to shoot. Now, even though it may be the faster shot, you know, sometimes because you catch it, it doesn't speed up your shot. It, it, you catch it in shooting position, so it just gets on off. You don't have to guess or second guess where you're going to get it. Not everybody uses dime. I think I use it on uh, silver or something like that and silver uh, floor general. But a lot of people... A lot of people they don't they don't like to catch it on diamond because they want to try to learn that one timing, but you just can't do that in this game. If you just try to learn one timing in this game, it's not gonna work for you. I'm sorry, but hey, my guy Air Samurai, he said that's that 2K hood logic, man. I always shoot better when someone has diamond, but then again, I time every shot with no meter, uh, layups and shots. So I'm I'm just watching the animation. Exactly, Samurai. That's what I'm talking about, Big Sam. Yes, you have to just watch the animation. You can't watch nothing else. Catch it here, it's gonna be fast. Watch the animation fast. Catch it here, watch it, it's, it's gonna be the normal timing. But the problem is a lot of people have their shots because somebody tell somebody done told you, hey man, you ain't got no skill unless you're shooting on very early. So if you're shooting on very early, guess what? It's gonna be very difficult to time the shot. It just is what it is. Uh, I know that a lot of people probably don't believe that, 
but it is it's just a fact of the matter if you if you try to uh if you're trying to to shoot the ball and you're trying to shoot it on very early then you're probably doing yourself a disservice unless you're a dribble shooter. If you're an off the uh, catch shooter, you're probably doing yourself a disservice. Last but not least, man, my guy, Laker fan, another coin you copy. He says, in this game on offense versus defense, wherever it's easy to be good is where your talents are needed the least. You can you can look at 5v5s as a defensive game and feel like you like you had no impact as a guard. But the good guards make their impact felt and so like somebody like my guy see it or whatever man like he will play the game and uh, a lot of people probably you know they'll think that that he ain't you know he's in the corner he can't really do too much as a guard or whatever but guess what see it being in that corner the good guards make their impact felt because you can't pass that pass that pass in the corner on a good guard he gonna steal that thing even with like 25 steal or something like that now i know that might not be the case now but y'all understand what i'm saying if you are a good guard you will try you will you will make your impact felt some type of how if they try to iso you you're gonna make it difficult you're gonna push him to one guy whatever like that you know you can't stop him straight up so you will play to your strengths and that's what you have to be doing man don't be your own worst enemy out there man you gotta play to your strengths figure it out and just keep going but but like we can't just think that everything's just gonna work out for us and then we ain't put no work in or whatever like that but like i said though, a lot of times where we are is because of ourselves and like i said a lot of pain is self-inflicted and we are where we are because you know that's what we ask for like i said monday you get what you ask for and that's just is what it is but like i said a lot of times we are our worst enemy not only in this game, but in life, man. Y'all just think about that. This is food for thought today. Let's get out of our own way, get together, and show these boys what's happening, man. Now get out there and have yourself one hell of a day, man. And I'm going to holler at y'all next time till next time. It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Coach Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Volvo Shop, VK the People's Champ. Gosh,